Recently, I faced the problem of data transfer between smartphones from Android to Android and then between different operating systems from iOS to Android and vice versa. In this case, one of the main problems was the impossibility of transferring WhatsApp chats together with the other data. Let's see if I can find a method to solve this problem. Ciao, my name is Mirko and this is how I did it. Browsing internet, I tried to understand if it is possible to transfer chats between different operating systems. After some research, I found several programs that allow you to solve this problem, but all not free. I also noticed that it is more convenient to focus on programs that allow data transfer in one direction. If I have an Android phone and I want to switch to iOS, I don't need to be able to go back and so I can use cheaper programs. Same thing for the reverse transfer from iOS to Android. In this video I will deal with the transition from Android to iOS. The program that I choose to use for this experiment is the CapTrans that allow you to read and save chats and all the multimedia contents of the WhatsApp from an Android phone and copy everything on the target iPhone with few clicks. Let's see if it works. After reading some guides on the site, I buy, download and install it. Let's move on to the Android phone. I will use an Asus Zenfone Life with WhatsApp installed and active. First, you need to enable the developer options by clicking 7 times on the build number, then activate the USB debugging. Now I can connect the phone to the PC. It gives me an error. We are not starting very well, but it is probably because the device is not configured yet. I try to close the program and reopen it. This time only a warning. I click OK and then the installation of the app interface on the phone starts. Perfect. The program now works that it will downgrade the WhatsApp app. OK. I perform a backup of the chats. And now begins the data reading. All chats have been copied and are available. I can easily navigate between the various conversations and consult the contents of the chats. Now let's move on the target iPhone. I will use an iPhone 5. First I disable the lock screen timer, then also find my iPhone and the iCloud backup. Then I download WhatsApp and connect the iPhone to the PC. It is detected and tells me to activate the application. Then begins the device reading. Reading completed, but gives me an error. I try to disconnect the phone and reconnect it.
everything is fine. Now just select the ASUS and click on the button with the arrow. Select the target phone and wait. Finish it. I wait for the iPhone to restart. I reactivate the protections and then check the results. The chats have been transferred and also their contents. Furthermore, the procedure didn't influence, in any way, the data already present on the device or other applications. Overall, the software worked very well. The transition was complete. Messages, images, documents, videos, everything that was present in the ASUS chats are present on the iPhone. There were a couple of error messages, but with a simple detach and attack, they were solved in no time. Definitely a successful experiment. Soon the reverse transition from iOS to Android. We'll see if something changes. If you like the video, remember to subscribe to the channel and follow me on my social. Ciao!